If you love spreadsheets, you're usually a producer. There's a lot of emails, there's a lot of phone calls, there's a lot of paperwork. I mean, really, it's just paperwork. The job is paperwork. But it's also a creative role. So you're working very closely with the um, writers and directors. Coming up with ideas, working with the creative team. Scheduling that production. Uh, script writing along with the client, meetings, that sort of thing. There's a temperament involved, which is very important. I think you, you need to be the kind of person who doesn't let a lot phase you. I never take no for an answer, so it's about being tenacious. You've got to come across some crazy stuff in, in, in your dealings with people and your negotiations, and if you let that affect you, um, things are going to come off the rails pretty quickly. The thing that makes a good producer is the ability to communicate with people well and, of course, get the job done on budget and on time. How do you become a producer? Step one is going out and, um, you know, finding a project, motivating people to become a part of that project. Don't be the hands-on guy that wants to do everything. Let other people do that, but you give them your vision as the producer. And then doing everything you can to make that happen. There's no single way, I don't think, for any role in the film industry for you to get in anymore. It used to be a, a very set path. Now it's just do what you can um, to learn the, the trade and you're only going to learn by doing.